Sources tell us that a registered nurse yesterday while on the job tried to take with her pocket two syringes full of the Pfizer vaccine. Another employee saw it all happening, got security, got Detroit police. When they try to confront this nurse, she apparently refused to answer questions and then asked for a lawyer. Very fortunate at, you know, 100,000 doses uh, administered that we've had no uh, significant events up until Monday night. That is when a nurse was caught in the act trying to steal vaccines. We were made aware that uh, one of our nurses was attempting to um, steal a couple syringes of vaccine. We then uh, detained her and she's being fully investigated. Hakeem Barry, the top city of Detroit official overseeing the TCF operation, says the contract RN was still inside the TCF center when she was detained, then arrested by Detroit police. We have a culture and environment of if you see something, say something. And uh, uh, another staff member saw something and they reported it. The two doses of the Pfizer vaccine she was trying to steal now in police evidence and cannot be used on the people who need them. I am really shocked. Um, the access to vaccines that have come into Michigan and into Southeast Michigan is not called for. Barry says there is security and Detroit police officers inside and outside of the facility. Cameras are everywhere. Um, our vaccines are stored off site in a very secure location that's alarmed and 24 seven security around that. Whenever the vaccines are delivered from the pharmacy to the nurse's station, they are accompanied with security officers. This nurse could face criminal charges and even lose her license. The man in charge here with parting words to the trusted nurse that did this. I, I'm not sure what your motives were and uh, uh, hopefully you can uh, uh, understand the severity of what you did. Pretty much business as usual today here out at TCF. Yesterday when this was all happening, uh, the city did want to make sure and let people know that anybody that was scheduled to get a vaccine yesterday did get their vaccine. The situation didn't interrupt that flow at all. Now in terms of a revamp of security here, the city says they already have so many layers in place to protect these vaccines. They're not going to do anything different to stay the course. Reporting downtown Detroit, Jessica Dupnak, Fox 2 News.